So the winner of Jazz Blazers tonight clinches Man. the third seed. Mm. Awesome. Jalen, who you got? Portland's playing at home. Utah's awesome. in a back-to-back -back situation. We just saw that terrific backcourt. Nurkic has been playing <laughs> terrific. I'm going with the Blazers to find a way to wrap up the third seed yeah. and do the unthinkable, just like the Utah Jazz have the entire season. I'm with you, buddy. They're they, they playing at home. They got the Jazz coming off a of back-to-back. Like you said, I'm, they got, and they got an MVP candidate. They got Dame Dollar man. at the house at Dame time. <laughs> I, hey, I feel right at home now it's, disagreeing it's, it's with Dame you. Time. Yay, I feel go. right at home. It's I'm Dame right time. back at home disagreeing with y'all. Portland's on a four-game losing streak. Right. Utah, six-game winning streak, one of the best defenses in the league. They're trending up. Portland is limping into the playoffs. I got Utah tonight, the dynamic rookie, Rudy Gobert, holding down the middle. This is uh. a young, exciting team to watch. I got to go with them tonight. And we got some good, fun games to watch. Who has it, if between those two, who has a better shot beating Warriors or Rockets? Uh, let me see. It's Jalen Paul. I would say Utah. Chauncey, Beta, we need one more. <laughs> hey, listen. You guys, I'm really good at We got Amina who said, we, listen, we got to stretch for it. And, and, and the, so no one? Nobody. No, really? Either one. Not even with, as you said, Utah surging in, getting hot at the right time. No, Utah nothing. Utah can push. Well, the only thing is, the only push thing is no, no Steph Curry. Steph. No we got to think about no Steph Curry, though. I was going to say 40 second, points last night happened. That's the second round. It might be Steph might be back. He might be, but he also might not. Well, if he's not, then that's a different story. I mean, maybe us five can go do something with him. <laughs> but it would be a great feat for either one of these teams to get out of the first round because right if you look back at the projections of the season, Utah, as you mentioned, and I, and I see why you're picking them in a lot of ways, they lost Gordon Hayward. They traded uh, Rodney Hood. They were said to be the future. Quinn Snyder's done a terrific job with this squad. Ingles came out of nowhere. He make it three easy playmakers. Yes. Can I argue something, though? Because I want to argue the premise of what you said. Because you said if you look at the predictions or the projections before the season. And let's be honest. Those are not necessarily science. So it's almost as if we're basing expectations for some teams on just really guesses. No, so nobody. It seem, I mean, they don't seem to care. Like, the players don't seem to care. Not they a person on this earth except Donovan Mitchell thought he would lead that team in scoring this year. And nobody, no, and nobody thought they would be the number three seed. Nobody probably thought they would be in the playoffs. Right, but I mean, then what does that tell you? Flirting all, around. I'm, honest. Well, well I mean, what, it tell, what it tells you is they got a coach of the year candidate in Quinn Snyder, mm -hmm. and he's getting guys to play better than we all thought that they could together. I Ricky mean, they, they've Rubio. done a terrific job. They really have. The addition of Ricky Rubio, getting everybody to basketball. I mean, Gobert missed some time mm -hmm. during the season. Too. A lot of time. There's a lot of things that could have happened that this should be the team fighting to play, get into the playoffs tonight for the 7-8 seed. Oh, That's chilling. what we thought. They're chilling. That's what we thought. I can't, I can't front. I was Gotta watching. give them credit. I was watching the game last night, and they were stomping the Warriors by 40. I'm like, I really don't know who rookie of the year is. Well, we have well, you one more Well, you want me to help you out? Yeah. Uh, Ben Simmons. Simmons. Oh, there you go. <laughs> 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 uh, ben Simmons. <laughs> Perennial playoff attendee.